Hi, Nati. Good night. Good night, Nati. How are you, girl? Hi. Hey, hello. How you doing, Nati? I'm fine. And you? I'm fine. I'm happy. I'm glad to see you. I thought, oh my God, they are on vacation or what? <laughs> There's nobody else in the classroom? Yeah, well, only you and Anita and me. Well, now you and I. Okay. <laughs> so that's good. Maybe they're on the way home. Or it's, you know what? Today's a lot of traffic. Yes, a lot of traffic. Yes. I don't know because yesterday uh, there are some people that got paid. I don't know. Uh, but today you cannot imagine. I was out with my husband because um, we decided to uh, take like a cup of coffee or have a cup of coffee before the class today. And uh, well, we're like, oh my God. I, and I told him, I need to be on time to my classes today. So we went to like uh, a near play here. And then uh, I think we took the route uh, from um, zoo, the zoo, the Costa Rica. The zoo, yeah. You, you yes. know where the zoo is? The zoo, yeah. Yes, for from San Jacinto. Oh yeah, like that. Uh, so we can be. It, it was a long distance, but we could be on time because if we tr if we took the other route, the one that comes from to Zima, right, and mm -hmm. everything. Oh my God, yes. that's a chaos. Yes, that's oh, really God. horrible. Oh, horrible, and I was like, oh my God, and I need to be on time for my boys. They will kill me if I'm not on time. So yeah. We had like a, we were supposed to think in another yeah, different type of dinner, but well, we decided to have a, a little light dinner today. <laughs> so that's good. Oh, At least I had my cup of coffee. <laughs> you know, I cannot live with coffee. I, I love coffee by heart. I'm a it's coffee holic. Coffee. Yeah, I love coffee. But, but, but the great coffee, of course. Oh, of course, yeah. Of course, great coffee. My mother said, okay, I know because she doesn't drink coffee because for her diabetes, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, there's some food and drinks that she has to avoid, and but she always have coffee, like instant coffee, because for for us, right? But I but but I said, oh, Mama, why you brought this coffee that you need that you can boil it? Um, is coffee is coffee? No way, coffee is not coffee. Okay, yeah, you can buy like um a little um one that you can go on the, to the store, right, or the grocery store, but it's not the same. Yes. Uh, of a great coffee and my mother said okay you, your husband so his name is salvador so he said oh salvador he, he always like uh he's not like satisfied with the, with the one that i have or the instant one is it <laughs> because it's not the same when you already know uh how a great coffee tastes you are so picky yeah coffee. well in my case i'm really picky with coffee where is the place that you have tried your favorite coffee Mm, my favorite coffee. Well, I think it was in a mm, in a taco. I think in a taco. Yeah, I think in a taco. Well, I love all the coffee that are like from the high mountains, like a taco, a paneca, a palma, uh, alegria, sultan. Of course, I love them. Uh, but this is a really uh, that's those are places that I that I loved to, to drink coffee because I know that they are pure, right? Yes. Uh, they're put and uh, but uh, here mm, i think a starbucks is a really good coffee i like it mm -hmm. uh, what else i don't what is the other, other place that i love coffee <gasps> well i traveled the, oh yeah um uh, the panoramic route mm, yes yeah there is a there's a place there that is the big house in the spanish it's like a sauna uh basically there's a really good coffee really look, look, no. great one and what else? Uh, there's another place here. Well, I like Pizza Hut coffee. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I like Mr. Donut coffee. Um, what I do not like is uh, oh my god, what is the other one? Coffee, coffee cup. I don't like coffee cup. Coffee cup. Because for me, it's really I don't know what's happening. But it's strong, but my tummy doesn't like it. Mm, okay. But 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 every coffee that is like pure, I love it. Of course, and. Colombian coffee, I love it, and Costa Rica coffee as well. Yes, people say it's that really nice. coffee is is very it's, it's really good. Yeah, Costa Rica coffee. There's another one. Oh, Nicaragua coffee. It's really good as well. 
but Costa Rica is really nice. I like it. Well, every time that I go there, but I don't know when I'm going to go back there. But um, I brought some coffee. They call it Torreado. Torreado. Yeah, because of the machine. Mm -hmm. There is a, a machine that it, it is uh, at the top. There is like a little bag mm -hmm. with a specific design. I don't know the, um, what, how can I say it? Well, uh, it's like a tela. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's like colador, right? Mm -hmm. So you put, so you put the, the, the cup of the coffee above it and just put the coffee uh, on the colador and then you add it the hot water and this like it comes a little chorrito right mm -hmm. that's why it calls chorreado yeah. but it's, it's really because of the machine that they use they're like um really uh rustic machines mm -hmm. like artisanal machines and the one that are more fancy right but i prefer the ones that are like uh, uh, ordinary because it's really really good yeah and they are for different flavors some of them are like chocolate flavor and other one um Blueberry flavor is really nice. Okay. And yes, I love it. I love coffee. So as long as it's from the high mountains, for me, it's fine because I know that it's pure. They don't have they haven't mixed anything else. Yes, there are coffees that you can put it uh, some vanilla, vanilla. Vanilla, yeah, of course. Yeah, I love it, but I prefer pure coffee because uh, uh, when you drink pure coffee, you can like absorb the vitamins of the coffee actually i try not to mix it with uh, with milk or with sugar but sometimes you like a coffee with milk right and sometimes you want to add some sugar in it so I, I i'm not saying that i'm not never do it i do i do it sometimes but i prefer to taste the flavor of the coffee mm, okay. I how many love. drinks do you drink in the, in the day I, well, for me, I wish I could drink more than five, but no, <laughs> I, no, 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 no. I just drink like uh, two, maximum three. Oh, okay. Maximum three. Yeah, is it because for my hypertension, I had to like, mm, well, yeah, yeah. Okay. but it, but those uh, coffee that are really good, the one that are natural doesn't affect me. Mm. Affects me the one that you, yeah, you buy at the supermarket. Like Listo, Muzum, Cascave, those <laughs> are not good for me. But the, the the natural ones, no, it's really good. But I try not to abuse, right? Right. Even though I love it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like coffee and also teas, any kind of teas. Yeah, I have a tea collection. Yes, they are very delicious. Mm -hmm. uh, once I try some peach tea. Oh, that's good. Yes, really good. What about curcuma? Yes, I already tried that. It's really, it's really good and healthy. Yes. Also red tea and white tea. Yes, green tea also. Also green tea, yeah, and chai tea. Yes. This is really good. Yeah, I tried to have it from different ones. Now I'm missing three things. Well, every time that I come to Costa Rica, or my niece comes from Costa Rica, she always brings white tea and red tea because you can find easily there. No McCormick mm -hmm. one. No, 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 I need, I need the pure one. Yes, because there, there are a lot of Chinese and Japanese people there. So you can find like pure teas. Also, you can find like jasmine tea mm -hmm. that is from the flower. Oof. That's really good. Also help for depression. That's really good. But here you can find it, but it's really expensive. It is. So I'm searching, I'm Googling for some tea shops so I can go and buy some. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, talking about teas, Tanya. Hi. Hi, she said, <laughs> uh, stop talking about teas. Like, oh. <laughs> All right. Hey, Tanya, we miss you yesterday. What happened to you, right, Nati? Yeah. She's not, she was not here. Yeah. What happened? It was too much traffic, a lot of work I'm to do. Busy. Yeah. We yeah. busy? Mm. Yeah. yeah, I imagine that. I imagine. Yeah, that's what it was. Okay, where is Nati? Where, no, not this here, but where is Tanya? Okay, but I'm happy that you're here and you made it. Yeah, because it's just our last week. So we gotta like, try to like, yeah. oops, 
for a little bit. Hey, tell me, guys, uh, do you have work to the platform? Did you finish or no yet? Uh, off, off. off almost? Okay. Yeah, you have until the Thursday to finish. Thursday. Yeah, okay. yeah, please do it. You can finish. If you finish sooner, that would be awesome. Okay. Yeah. And if you have any question, of course, we can discuss it like the last day that we did. We can discuss it. So everybody goes on the same page. I know there are some exercises that would be like, <laughs> but now you can finish. You can use, you can do it um, all of section four. You can do it already. If you have any doubts on that, I uh, will help you because in the section four, we have the midterm, right? The midterm exercise. Yeah. Yeah. So it's really important that you finish it. Okay. And if you have any question, of course, you can send information. I can just answer you right away, or we can do it the same thing that we just did on the last class. We can just take 10 or 15 minutes, discuss, and everybody can do it together, right? So you can get a really good score also. Yeah. Hey, I, we also have Rachel. Can you imagine? Yes, you, you see, Nati, I have a hypothesis. <laughs> And, and that came true. When um, Tanya and Rachel are here, Rosario and Selvin are not here. Gotcha. And when the <laughs> Selvin and Rosario are here, Nati and Rachel are not here. So you see, <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on here. I think they said, you go on Thursday, then you know, Wednesday and like that, right? <laughs> One day of difference. <laughs> All right, let's listen, Rachel. Rachel, how are you, girl? Hello, girl. Rachel. Hi, how Hi, you good doing? Night. Good night. <laughs> yes, Mita is here. Bravo. Yeah, girls night. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, we wanna, we wanna see you, Rachel. We wanna see your Excuse beautiful, me? we wanna see your beautiful face today. <laughs> Doesn't matter if you have a makeup or put some hair. <laughs> That's okay. Right, Tanya? Yeah. Women are right. really beautiful. Natural way, we're beautiful. Oh, we're <laughs> beautiful. Oh, you don't want to show your face to think. <laughs> um, well, uh, tell us the truth. Don't worry. You I, haven't taken a shower. Wear... That's okay. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I couldn't sleep very well. So Ooh. I have my eyes. Oh. I don't know. How can I say? <laughs> Oh, so you're you have a sleepy eyes. Yeah. Oh, a sleepy eyes like, uh, like a that? sleepy eyes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, so. Okay, I got it. Okay, don't uh, worry. I'm so sorry, but uh, I don't know. Maybe I will. I will get sick. No, hopefully I not. Think. Hopefully not. <laughs> uh, I I don't know, but I don't feel very well. Ooh. So, mm -hmm. oh no, 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 that's okay. So, uh, as long as you're here, why I, <laughs> that's why I couldn't be here yesterday. Oh, I understand. Yeah. No, I understand. Hopefully, you don't feel you don't get worse. It's just like a, a little flu or something like that, or a little cold. Okay, <laughs> but that's okay. Don't worry about it. Okay, we, we have your image okay, here in our face, you. so we know that you're pretty. <laughs> so that's okay don't worry but you came okay, in a really good time you. right you know no thank you for being here even though you do not feel good you feel you are here so that shows a commitment i'm so happy every time that i see you <laughs> and you know what i'm happy because it's going to be girls night okay <laughs> yeah and actually just to let you know a recap girls uh, is um, tanya and rachel to yesterday we were talking about it was really good exercise yesterday right we talk about a lot of things we talk about communication transportation uh what else we did ah entertainment and you know what girls yesterday we we mix three bird tenses remember we just past we just present and we just future for talking about the same topic is really nice because we made like a time contrast <laughs> yeah that was really really good with a really good experience and I, of course i left uh, a homework hopefully you have done it okay as an exercise practice we're going to double check it in a few minutes okay don't worry about that today guys we're going to continue with that but now Today's class, even though it's going to be time contrast as well, but we're going to focus on two skills today. We're going to focus the listening skill 
and continue focusing the speaking skill with the pronunciation included. That's what I want. So right now, let's start with something. Let's start with the pronunciation, okay? I want you guys to pay attention how we use, for example, we can say it as a child, in the past, na, na, na. what would be the intonation? I'm just going to play the audio for you. And I just want you just guys to listen carefully when you start speaking about something that you did in the past or with the present in the future, how you would need to like pronunciate to emphasize what it, the bird tense you are talking about. That is really, really important. So let me just a couple of minutes. And uh, before we do that, I would like to share something with you, just for you to have it. Because in the meantime, while you are listening, I want you guys also to read what I'm going to send it to you. So in this case, also, we're going to develop the reading. We're going to do two things right now at the same time, reading and listening at the same time. We're going to develop the two skills, okay? So let me just a couple of minutes, let me try to pop it up and I will send it to you right now through the WhatsApp. Bear with me for a couple of minutes. There you go, I have it here. Once you have it, let me know because I will going to play the audio and in the meantime, we're playing the audio. I want you to uh, also uh, read the information that I will send it to you. Okay, there you go. Okay, just let me know, girls, as soon as you're able to receive it, please. Did you receive it already? Yep. Yes. Okay, cool. So yeah. basically, that's the paper. That's the, and I want you guys to, to, to take a look. We're going to play the three sentences. If you see, guys, the first sentence is talking about past. The second sentence talking about future, and the third sentence, talk, sorry, the second sentence about present and the third about future. But I want you guys to pay attention or when the person that is pronunciated, it pronunciate uh, in the past, today, in the future. And also I want you guys to pay attention or how they pronunciate at the end of each sentence. That's what I want you to do. So I, I, I'm, let me share right now my screen and I will let you know when you're going to listen. Okay. Uh, can you see my screen right now, girls? A little bit? Yeah. Okay, cool. Just pay attention, okay? Listen carefully. Page 59, exercise four, pronunciation. Intonation in statements with time phrases. Part A, listen and practice. Notice the intonation in these statements beginning with a time phrase. In the past, very few people used computers. Today, people use computers all the time. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. Okay, girls. Let me put it one more time to double check again the intonation, okay? And then we're going to practice everybody. Page 59, exercise 4, pronunciation. Intonation in statements with time phrases. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice the intonation in these statements beginning with a time phrase. In the past, very few people used computers. Today, people use computers all the time. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. Easy peasy quizzy, right? Yeah, let's practice that. Okay. Uh... Tanya, can you please read for me the three sentences? Okay. In the past, very five people used computers. Again, very five or very few? Ah, very few. <laughs> Don't worry about that. <laughs> yes, we're five, but no, we're not, they are not talking about us. Go ahead. <laughs> Today. No, the, people... the first one, the first ah. one. Uh -huh. <laughs> sure. In the past, very few people use computers. Mm -hmm. Today, people use computers all the, all the time. Mm -hmm. In the future, 
there will be a computer in the every home. Very good. Do it again, the last one, please. You can do it. In the future, there will be there will be a computer in every home. Very good. Excellent. Okay, Nati, now you. In the past, very few people used computers. Mm -hmm. okay. People use computers all the time. Mm -hmm. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. Very good. Sulmita, can you continue, please? Now is your turn, girl. Okay. In the in the past, very few people used computers. Very good. Today, people use computers all the time. In the future, there will be a computer in our home. Very good. Excellent. Good job. All righty. Rachel, now is your turn. Yeah. In the past, very few people used computers. Today, people use computers all the time. Mm -hmm. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. Very good. Excellent, girls. Very good job. And also, I need to congratulate Sulmita and also Rachel because of the you of the first sentence, very few people used. I heard that you that you, you use that you use the D at the end. Used. Very good. Very good job. Because basically that is a past tense of use, right? It's a verb. It's a regular verb. Excellent job. Okay, girls. So you see how we detonate? In, in this case, we emphasize the first thing in the past. That means that we're talking about something that we did in the past. Today, right? In the future. And then at the end of the sentence, we low down. Very good. Okay, now guys, let's practice with some information for our own. Let me do something else. We will continue with this. Now, girls, uh, I'm going to send you here an information and I want you guys to complete the statements with your own information. Then you're going to read the statements with, to your partner and I want you guys to pay attention of the intonation. So I'm going to send it to you, one, two, three, four, five, six sentences but no complete sentences. It will be the first part of the sentence. And I want you guys to complete it with your own information. Let me double check. Let me send it to you one more time. There you go. And also guys, it, when you complete it, you, I need you to pay attention with the intonation. We're practicing right now the intonation. Let me know if you receive it, please. You did? Yeah. There you go. Okay, so we have yeah. six sentences, if you see here. We have, as a child, I used to, five years ago, I, nowadays, I, and then we have, these days, in five years, I'll, in 10 years, I might, you see? So you need to emphasize it. Okay, right now, because, uh, yes, we can do pairs, right? <laughs> okay, so we're going to work together, girls. Uh, 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 let's work together. Okay, let me check I'm, who I'm going to put with who. <laughs> All righty. Okay, let me assign uh, Nati. I'm going. You need to work with Sumita. And Rachel, you're going to work with Tanya. Okay, I'm going to send you the invitation. Please, girls, try to put it in practice. Uh, I want you guys to give information to your partner of your own situation. As a child, I used to be messy, right? You know what messy is? Yeah. yeah? Like if your room are in disorder, it's a chaos, that's a messy, okay? So just use that information of your of your own, okay? Don't complicate your life. What I want, what I want you to, to do is to practice the intonation, the thing that we have learned right now, and I will listen to you, okay? There okay. you go. Okay, accept the invitation, please, girls. <clears throat> Anybody has zip? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, okay. Let me see Rachel and Natty. Very good. Oops. Everybody is together, right? <laughs> I know. Don't worry about that. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. I want you guys to practice between you, okay? 
Pretend that I'm not here. Who can I start? Okay, Nati, go ahead. As a child. Okay. As a child, I used to eat a lot of candies. Okay. And now pick another classmate and continue, girls. Okay, Sulmita. Use another one, okay? Another one of that of the one that you have there. Uh, five years ago, I I used to play doors. Okay, continue. Another one. Pick another classmate. Uh, pick Tania. No way they. I study English. Excellent, but we're enthusiastic. Nowadays, <laughs> nowadays <laughs> I study English. You say nowadays, okay. Continue, girls. I want you to practice all of it. Aha, uh -huh. pick another one, Rachel, Nati, Sulmita, okay. So, Rachel? Right, right. <laughs> uh, yeah, yes. Um, thinking about these days, it's like these days in the past or in the future. These days is are you think you think it's going to be if I say these days, am I talking about present? Am I talking about past or future? It doesn't matter. It is matter because I said these days, that means today. Oh right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's like nowadays, it's the same. Okay. These days I've been working. Excellent. Very good job. Okay, Nati, continue. Okay, in five years, I will have a better job. It's, it's, it's nice to keep dreaming. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Very good. Excellent. Okay, pick another girl, Nati. Go ahead. Okay, Sulmita. There you go, girl. In 10 years. Okay. In 10 years, I meet I might. the mother. You might I, be I a might. mother? I might. Ooh. Yeah. Mm. yeah. And all of us, we're going to be aunties. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Very good. Excellent. Pick another one. Uh, Sulmita, another girl. I pick Rachel. Rachel. Okay, Rachel, your toy will be as a child. Okay. Ooh. As a child, I used to play with my sister. Okay, very good. Now pick another one, Rachel. Okay, Tanya. Tanya, in five years, Tanya, talk about future. Uh, six years ago, I five, married. Six. Five years ago. Oh, oh okay. Oh, six oh, years? Six, six. Ah, okay. Yes. Sorry. All it's right. True. It's true. It's true. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know it's true. Yes, because you got married when you were 24, right? Okay. See, oh, that's yes. cool. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Now pick another one, Tanya. Uh, Nati. Nati, in 10 years. In 10 years, I might be a grandma. A grandma? Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. She, no. she doesn't even have a boyfriend. How come? <laughs> well, well, it depends. If you have a pet, yes, that counts. I might be a mother. Ah, okay. I'm grandma. <laughs> that's so <laughs> funny. <laughs> but, well, but that's okay. Yeah, yeah, because you could be a grandma if you have pets, right? So good. Yeah. right. I'm already a grandma. Can you imagine? Four times I've been grandma. Of whiskey, of course. <laughs> okay, very good. Pick somebody else. Uh, Nati, go ahead. Uh, Rachel. Okay, Rachel, uh, 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 uh. five years ago. Five years ago, I was living in another country. Uh, excuse me, where? Um, Belize. Belize? Are you from yeah. Belize? No. <laughs> ah, okay, you were there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I that's... was living there, yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Hey, you speak English there. You had to. Uh... The English in that place, mm -hmm. it's not like 
in Latin America. I or, know. Or United States. You I know, I know. When, it's totally different. Yes, I know that. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, sometimes I couldn't understand them. Yes, I know. Because it, 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 it is a little bit difficult to talk. To talk with to them? Think. Yes. Uh, yeah. They, uh -huh. Sometimes they mix their own words. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I know I understand them a lot. <laughs> yes, I know. And it's really hard to understand people from Canada as well. Also from Belize for now Australia. Oof, you cannot imagine. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> oh, but it's nice. I, it's nice that at least you already have the experience. Very yeah. good. <laughs> okay, pick another another but and everybody. And it's anything else? Anybody else? Tanya, Sulmita, Nati, I don't know. Okay, Sulmita. Okay, so meet that as a child, please. <laughs> okay, as a child, I used to, I used to play with dolls. Ah, with you're... dolls. With dolls. Okay, very good. Pick somebody else. I. I... Tanya, you said. I pick. Yeah. Tanya. Tanya. Okay, Tanya. In ten yeah. years. <laughs> in 10 years i might uh, you might be i might have a company you might have a what a company a company yeah a company Empresa? oh your own company your enterprise ah yeah. okay so you can say my own company my own company oh, oh my own business very good excellent girls excellent excellent so like let's come back together in the real plot okay very good okay let's come back together excellent girls excellent job <laughs> We are everybody together. Okay, very good. Now, girls, we're going to continue right now. We're going to continue. We're listening uh, exercise. And this is what I'm going to do. I will send it to you right now um, as more chapter, was more chart. And basically, guys, I want, I'm going to play this audio two times. Now it's time for us to put, practice the listening. And then we're going to come back with the speaking, okay? This time... Uh, you're going to hear people talking about different topics. I think three topics. All that I want to do is that uh, you listen carefully and you check whether it's better or worst. Okay? Just better or worse. That's all that I want you to listen carefully on the first time. And then I will let you know what will be the instructions for the second listening. Okay? So let me just a couple of minutes. Let me send it to you. Just let me know as soon as you're able to receive it. Here you go. Okay, you're going to listen. People discuss changes. That's why we use uh, time contrast. And you need to check uh, whether the person, the topic of each person talks about, okay? Okay, let me check. Do you receive it, girls? Yep. Yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, if you see, girls, we have one, two, and three, right? And we have, yeah, we have population, transportation. What are our topics that we have, girls? Transportation, families, environment. Mm -hmm. What else? Shopping. Exactly. So what you what I want you to do right now is to listen to the people discuss the changes, and I want you guys to check. Right. Well, you cannot check on the on the on your cell phone, right? But just to pay attention to each topic people talks about. Okay, that's what I want to know. Okay, so listen carefully. You understand what you're gonna do? Yep. Yeah? Easy peasy queasy, right? Like piece of cake, of course. 
Okay, so let me just a couple of minutes because we're continuing with the listening part. Let me check if this is... Uh, oh yes, that's the one. There you go. So let me just share right now my screen. Do, 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 do. There you go. Page 60, hey, exercise five, listening, for better or for worse. Part A. Listen to people discuss changes. Check the topic each person talks about. 1. How long have you been living here? Oh, for over 20 years. And have you noticed a lot of changes during that time? Oh, yes, quite a few. This is a much nicer place to live now than it used to be. It's much greener. When I first moved here, there weren't many trees around. But over the last few years, the city has planted trees everywhere. It's made such a difference. Two. How do you like living here? Well, it's an interesting city, but you really need a car here. You can't go anywhere without one. There used to be a good bus system, but there isn't anymore. Why is that? Oh, I think they expect everyone to have a car so they don't bother to provide decent bus service. It's getting worse and worse. These days, you have to wait a long time for a bus. And when one finally shows up, it's usually full. Three. I can't believe how much this neighborhood has changed. What do you mean? Well, when Joe and I first bought this house, that was almost 20 years ago, of course, there were lots of young couples with children living on this street. I don't see any kids out today. That's because they've all grown up and moved out of their parents' houses. The only young children we see around here these days are the grandchildren when they come to visit. It's too bad. I miss the sounds of kids playing. It's gotten way too quiet around here. Okay, girls. So you see, the three people talk about different things. For example, the first one, uh, what do you think the topic was about? Was population or environment? Which environment. of those? Environment, exactly. What about number two? Transportation. Transportation, exactly. Number three? Population or cities? Mm -hmm. It could be your family or shopping. Which one? Um, families. Families, exactly. Because they were talking about that there are not too many kids, right? Playing. Okay. Okay, now that we already identify it, the topic, for example, the first one was environment. Let's repeat, okay? The second one, Tanya said it's transportation. And the third one, talking about, um, Rachel said that as families. Okay, now, girls, I want you to do something. I'm going to play the audio one more time. And I want you guys to pay attention of the changes. Okay, now we're going to pay attention of the changes for each uh, topic, okay? And also girls, I want you to pay attention if, if they think that it's for better or for worse now, okay? That's what I want you to pay attention to. You're, are you right, girls ready? Yep. Yeah. Cool, okay. Let's listen one more time. There you go. Page 60, exercise five, listening, for better or for worse. Part A, listen to people discuss changes. Check the topic each person talks about. One. How long have you been living here? Oh, for over 20 years. And have you noticed a lot of changes during that time? Oh, yes, quite a few. This is a much nicer place to live now than it used to be. It's much greener. When I first moved here, there weren't many trees around. But over the last few years, the city has planted trees everywhere. It's made such a difference. Two. How do you like living here? Well, it's an interesting city. But you really need a car here. You can't go anywhere without one. There used to be a good bus system, but there isn't anymore. Why is that? Oh, I think they expect everyone to have a car, 
so they don't bother to provide decent bus service. It's getting worse and worse. These days, you have to wait a long time for a bus. And when one finally shows up, it's usually full. 3. I can't believe how much this neighborhood has changed. What do you mean? Well, when Joe and I first bought this house, that was almost 20 years ago, of course, there were lots of young couples with children living on this street. I don't see any kids out today. That's because they've all grown up and moved out of their parents' houses. The only young children we see around here these days are the grandchildren when they come to visit. It's too bad. I miss the sounds of kids playing. It's gotten way too quiet around here. All right, girls. So let's come back and discuss the listening part. The first one, the topic was environment, right? Yeah. Okay, so who can tell me what is the change that the girl talked about? What has changed in the neighborhood? Mm -hmm. Thank you, Tanya. Go ahead. The one. Yeah, number one. What is the change that she talked about? Uh, is, uh, is the popular? Uh, I don't know. Don't worry, don't worry. In Spanish. In, in Spanish. Of, in, no, 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 no. No Spanish. Okay, help her, guys. Help her. What is the change? What happened in the past? Now, now it's different because she's talking about environment, right? Yeah, I heard uh -huh. uh, there was, or oh, there were many trees. Uh, exactly. People mm -hmm. have planted many trees. Okay, exactly. So, you, do you think, girls, it is now better or worse? Better. Better, yeah, of course, exactly. What about number two? We're talking about transportation. Hey, what is exactly the problem that this guide mentioned? What, what has changed about transportation on the neighborhood when he lives? Nothing? The parking. Yeah, what? The parking? Okay, what else? There us the much. bus uh-huh what happened with the bus transportation there there's a lot of transportation public transportation or no. what no what happened what really happened because of the people that have too many cars mm -hmm. they less buses uh-huh so they he said they think that everybody must have a car right so do they care about public transportation or no No, that he, he thinks that uh, the government cares about public transportation or no? No, no, no right? No. It, how, do, do we have to wait 15 minutes for a public transportation or more than that? More than that. More than that. And when finally public transportation arrives, what did he said? It is empty. <laughs> no, it was. It's crowded. It's full. it's full. Exactly. So, girls, what do you think? Is worse or better? Yes, worse. Worse. Very good. And the last one, talking about families. What is exactly what she mentioned? What has changed? What happened in the past, she said, 20 years ago, because she said that uh, they bought their house 20 years ago. Uh, were there many children 20 years ago? Yes, there yes. were yes. many children. Uh-huh. But what happened now? What she said about now? Nowadays, what happened? Mm -hmm. so nowadays, that? there okay, are only one. Uh-huh. Are there many children nowadays on the streets? No. No. What happened to the children? They grow mm -hmm. up and they move to their parents' family, right? Now... What is the only children uh, that they listen to? The grandchildren when they come back home. So what she misses, Sulmita? What is the girl misses? Que es lo que extraña? What does it, what, what the girl misses? Que extraña la muchacha? Uh, she misses uh, the 
see the children mm -hmm. uh, living on the street. At, exactly. Uh, and the noise of the children, right? Because everything is quiet. Yes. Yeah, you, it's true. You know, girls. Well, Nati, you can say it. you have you have niece and nephews, right? Yeah. So when you have them around you, they are like playing and blah 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 blah. They're making a lot of noise. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, but when they leave from your house, everything it got quiet, right? Like book in a second. So you said, "Oh my God, really? The 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 kids make a lot of noise, but sometimes I miss that noise, right? Yeah. So that's what she said." The families have changed. So what do you think, girls? It's better or worse? Worse. 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 Exactly. So you see how they speak about uh, time contrast, girls? About past, about present. Exactly what we have done. Now, girls, this is what I want you to do. Uh, 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 uh -huh. You're going to interview <laughs> your partner, okay? We have uh, 10 minutes. You're going to interview your partner about his, in this case, her past, present, and hopes for the future, okay? That's what we are going to do. So you're going to interview each other, okay? I want you, and now, yes, you're going to be in pairs, I promise, okay? I promise. And after that, I want you girls to make a small paragraph about information of your partner, okay? So do you understand what you're going to do? You're going to interview. It will be like a like a top star. In English comparativo English star. Okay. Very good. That's what you're gonna do. Okay. So bear with me for a moment. Let me share right now. Let me check. Okay. I'm going to create one of them. Uh, yes. Create it again. Here you go. Okay, there you go. I already sent it to you the invitation. Please accept it. Nati and Rachel, we're going to work together and Tani and Solmita. Okay. There you go. The uh -huh. person in the future. Exactly. Okay. For example, Nati, you're going to interview Rachel, okay, about her past, a little bit about her present and, um, and her future. And you're going to predict something about her, right? Depends on what she's uh, I want you to but, write a little paragraph, but please don't say your partner's name, okay? okay. Only the information. Uh, let me read you an example, for example. Okay, let me read something to you. Uh, for example, this person moved to our school several years ago. She used to be the quietest girl in the class. Now she's in the drama club, loves to watch soap operas, uh, soap opera, sorry. Someday she will be a successful actress. She will be famous. She will star in movies and on TV. I think she'll be in like that, okay? So with that information, that's what, that's what I want. Only a, a small paragraph. Do you understand what you're gonna do? Okay. Okay, so I'm going to double check the other girls and I'll leave you, okay? Okay, teacher. Cool. Uh-huh, Tanya and Zulmita, do you understand what I'm gonna do? Yeah, for example, teacher, when I was a child, I used to play with dolls. Uh-huh, exactly. You're going to provide Tanya information about you in the past, about you in the present and the future. And Tanya, uh, I want you to write it down because you're going to let us know that information to everybody about Sulmita. But don't say your, the name, right? Don't say Sulmita things. No, 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 no. Just talk about it in general. For example, this person uh, used to be uh, the quietest girl in the high school, for example. Now she's in the drama club and something like that, right? And, and also you can predict, for example, uh, I think she will be a great TV actress, for example. Okay, I want you guys to use the time contrast, okay? That's what I want. 
Uh, you have two minutes to do that, and we're going to come back together. Okay. Do you understand? Okay. Yep. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. a easy quiz, right? Of course. Very good. You, are you planning to have children? Excuse me? Are you planning to get kids soon? No. No. No, we don't want to get kids. Okay, and are you studying or what are the the what are you going to do in the future? Okay, nowadays um I'm studying just English, but in the future I want to get I up uh, well maybe to get my own um, I I don't know if it is company but it is like negocio <laughs> uh, okay my own business yeah I want to get my own business and travel to another countries Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Now about you. Okay. Um, in the past, I used to live with my other three brothers and sisters. We are four. And nowadays, I only live with my dad because all of them are already married. And okay. in the future, Maybe I will like to, to live with my mom in the United States. Would you like to go to the United States and live with your mom? Yes, in the United States, yes. Okay. Yes. Hello. Hi, did you uh, finish? No? Can you? No, no, teacher, my in, my internet is, is the same. It's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, continue, okay? And I, I couldn't hear, I couldn't hear you, Tanya. Can you repeat, please? Okay. Uh, when I was a child, I play and the bicycle, I like to play bicycle. Yeah. And nowadays I play soccer. Mm. Uh, and in five months, I will a mother. In five? One. <laughs> really? Yeah. You, you are pregnant. Are you yeah. pregnant? Are you pregnant? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> uh, what? How? How do? How? How months do you have? Four months. Four months. Yeah. yeah. Four months. Almost five. Five. Yes. Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> Aha, uh -huh. we're good. We're here. We're back, girls. Excellent. Hey, how was the exercise? Do you like it? Do you learn something from your uh, something interesting, something amazing from your partner? Yeah. 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 Well, I knew it. Okay. Let's start with Nati. Okay, Nati. Give us a little bit of information about your partner. She five years ago she was living in Belize and she was working okay and nowadays she live she live with her boyfriend and in the future she will be keeping she will be studying English and ha have her own business oh. company, okay. and she will travel travel a lot all oh, right so she lives with her boyfriend right now and in the yeah. future she will she will be having or she will have. Uh, her own business. She will have her own business. Oh, that's amazing. Excellent. Very good. <clears throat> now let's listen to Sulmita. Sulmita. 
Okay, teacher. Right. Uh, she, uh, when I, when, when I when know, I, when she. Ah, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. sorry. When she was a child, I, I used to play bicycle. She used to play basketball, okay. Or oh, bicycle, or oh, she used to ride, ride the bicycle. Yeah, she used to okay. ride bicycle. Mm -hmm. um, nowadays, she plays soccer. Oh, that's great. Yeah, and the most interesting uh -huh. is in five months, she will be a mother. What? Are you serious? Yeah. Hey, congratulations, Tani. You see, I told you girls, we're going to be aunties. Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, so that means that you have four months. Yes. Four months. Oh, my God. I'm tired. You're tired? Oh, you know what? I wish we could do a baby shower for you. Oh, that would be really nice. Well, 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 maybe if I month the things changes. Right? <laughs> that would be really nice. And we can make a baby shower for you. Oh, that's amazing. I'm so happy for you. Yay. We're going to have a new brown new student. Yeah. Yes. Yes. No, you know what? Now he's learning English, he or she. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So so continue reading English, okay? Listen to music and everything. Yeah. Your baby will listen. That's amazing. Oh. <laughs> yeah. No, she's listening right now. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy for you. Congratulations, Tony. Congratulations Thank to your you. husband. Hey. You know what? What <laughs> a really good them. way to, to end this class, girls, with a really great news. Yeah. Yeah. You see, we already finished. Oh, my goodness. It was really fast, right? <gasps> wow. Two days more. Yeah. And like, <laughs> we're finished. <laughs> but don't think about it. Don't think about it. We still have two more days to go. Okay, girls, I'm so happy to have you in today's class. And also happy with Tanya's news. That's amazing. <laughs> All righty. So I will give you hugs and kisses. And, and see you tomorrow, okay? Okay, teacher. Bye. 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 Take teacher. care. Bye-bye.